Alright guys, this is how I'm keeping track of my weights and stuff. I'm putting a number on each ingot, as you can see. That's ingot number 30. The numbers only started at 19 because the video I did of the single cylinder meltdown, I got 18 ingots. I was at number 18 at the end of that. So, I have the rest of these ingots here to weigh in number. And the way I'm doing it, sit y'all down here so you can see. I got my pad with my numbers on it. I'm going to go through here. I've got five spots. I've, actually, I've got eight spots on my table, but I only use five at a time. We're going to go 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. Okay. My scale is right here. Set the ounces. This is going to be ingot number 31. And it just so happens to weigh 31 ounces. We're going to call it 30.95. I don't want anybody to think I'm cheating. 30.95. Now we're going to take this ingot and we'll lay it over here on my table where I have 31 or where I have the one. I'm going to go back over here and we'll get another ingot. I'm going to call this one 32. Anyway, 20.55. Anyway, y'all get the gist of things. I'll be back old, be back with you in a minute. Alright, I got my five here. You see my numbers here, one, two, three, four, five. Which correspond to 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. My rubber pad. Use that one. I'm going to start with 35 first. And it's going to be 2500. 25.00. Upside down fire. There we go. Twenty five. Then we go over here. I get all of these done, and then I'll show you my next step. I hope you all see that number.
Well, I know my lighting's not very good, but I do the best I can. Anyway, those are the five that I picked out a while ago. Right, their weights are on, are stamped on them. I'm going to put them in the vise here in just a minute and stamp the numbers on them, and I'll get back to you. <clears throat> All right, y'all. Take him a number one here. Hopefully you can see it. 31. Put it on the stack. Go on to 32, so on, so on. I got probably 22 more of these to go. So, i get with y'all again. All right, y'all. There they are. Number 19 through 57. They're all numbered, weighed. I'm going to put this up and I will uh, go in the office and add the weights up and I'll finish this video. Alright y'all. The big ingot stack. There's 66 ingots there. I'm not sure what the weight's going to be but I'll be able to tell y'all here in just a little bit. Alright guys. I got it all totaled up here. Well, I got to work with the lighting I got. We came up with 1,014.80 ounces, which equals 63.425 pounds. Just out of the engine. Minus the carburetors. I kept the carburetors. So you take all the metal out of a Katana 600 engine, take the carburetors off, melt down just the aluminum, and you come up with just under 63 and a half pounds of just aluminum out of the engine. Now, I got some other videos out. I did a, I did a Kohler single. And I've got some random ingots and stuff. Anyway, there's all of the numbers for that. But they add up to, and right now, the big ingot stack weighs 107.85 pounds. I got another engine melt coming up. Um... I melted down an opposed, melted down an opposed Kohler that I had laying around that was locked up. Y'all be looking for that video. We're going to add that to the stack too. 
Y'all have a good one. Just bring it.